hi guys today we're going to see what is the use of styles dot render so normally styles dot render helps us to uh, uh, take the bundled uh, CSS and to display so uh, commonly uh, in my page I going to uh, refer uh, my uh, CSS that I can uh, do the bundling so I want to bundle the bootstrap dot CSS and the site dot CSS so uh, that I can uh, bundle with style bundle and I can call style dot render and I can render that bundle name so that is what the bundle name that I declared here okay uh, from the scratch I will explain you so normally uh, what actually the bundling does bundling helps us to compress uh, our the files so uh, here I <laughs> referring the two styles in my page one is uh, bootstrap CSS and the style okay so so in okay can okay, check let it be okay then I'll go the page and I'll okay uh, let me go to the index page so there I applied my layout okay so this is my layout if you see the page source so I have the two CSS that I referred so this two CSS normally if you inspect so it uh, takes me around uh, 90 seconds and the sites still it is pending yeah so memory catch it is loading I don't want that uh, let me do the control yes yep so this time see 120 milliseconds uh, for the styles and uh, uh, 311 millisecond for the bootstrap so uh, by using the bundle you can reduce the uh, seconds as well as the size of the file so what is the size of the file for the bootstrap is 118 and the site CSS is 881 byte so let me go and uh, enable the bundling so normally so I'll remove this uh, CSS and bundle where you can do is in app uh, start folder uh, you have the co called bundle configure in this bundle configure you have the register the bundle so this registered bundle you can add the how many bundles you want so how we can do achieve is bundle dot add you can create the new style bundle you can keep the name and include whatever the name of the CSS that you want to give okay so this is the two CSS I bundle in this name of contact dot CSS so once you added in the register dot bundle that you need to call it in a app start so bundle dot config registered bundle all the bundle table go, please register on the application start of that is what I am trying to tell so now uh, bundle is uh, enabled and it will be sitting here so if I enable this control K uncheck yes so now this render bundle it will render my bundle here and whatever the included CSS it will bundle and it will throw let me quickly open the same page in a different window so this time I'll inspect it So if you see the page source, so this is what the two styles uh, that is uh, bundled over there.
so now uh, bundle CSS that is applied uh, uh, it will be uh, thrown like this so if you using the complete uh, by using the render dot uh, style dot render so you will uh, render whatever the bundling way so you can uh, bundle the multiple CSS suppose you want bootstrap CSS and some other CSS to be uh, added that you can bundle it and you can call it wherever you want so by using the bundle it will helps us to uh, render the particular section of a block so you don't want to add up the unnecessary code in every pages so that is what all about the bundle is helps us to do so you can create the multiple uh, type of combination like um, see you want only the bootstrap you can go and add bundles dot add in that new style bundle okay new style bundle you can keep the name of the bundle called something like content slash only bootstrap include the CSS so here you can mention the path only the bootstrap So now if you uh, try to call this instead of uh, CSS bundle only the bootstrap will come into the picture so let me show you that too. Okay so let me go and build my application because this will be seated in my web application DLL so this is uh, my CSS page okay and now I added one more uh, bundling style bundle so that will going to reflect me so this time I am not included my style CSS so likewise you can uh, include a multiple combination of uh, CSS or the JavaScript JavaScript you can go ahead and use by script bundle so okay its application is built nicely so now refresh my page Okay, now uh, we'll see the page source. See, only the bootstrap is linked here. So by uh, uh, rendering the content slash bootstrap, it's uh, only included my content bootstrap CSS only. So hopes you understand what is a bundling, so how to use it. So you have a, a set of CSS uh, you want to map out of the view so this is very very helpful and it's very clean code you can easily render wherever you want you don't need to unnecessarily write uh, your uh, code manually by drag and drop or whatever the by link hash reference for 10 20 css it 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 will this will makes you a clean coder hopes you understand you go and uh, try this so we'll uh, see some other good topics in a future session thanks for watching the video guys if you have any doubt queries please comment us Please subscribe our channel if you have not subscribed before.